Hi, my name is Afnan. Uh, this is a video updates of my aquaponic system. I've completed the setup and uh, I have the tidied up most of the water inlet tubes uh, pipes and I've transferred the fishes from the old PVC tank into the newer tank that I made of the uh, canvas. Uh, let's have a look. This uh, black uh, growth bed, I uh, planted a few plants and I started it slowly because uh, eventually this system will, will have a lot more plants and uh, I've sprinkled some uh, chili and tomato seeds and in about one or two weeks they will be sprouting and uh, growing. Uh, it takes some time and now it's a uh, hot weather so uh, it's a bit hot over here in um, Kuala Lumpur, Malaysia the second growth bed I haven't grown anything it, I just letting in water to uh, cycle and the old fish tank uh, what I do now is I put fresh uh, fingerlings uh, let me switch off the water pump. I bought a few uh, red tilapia, uh, some uh, catfish, and some jelawat. I'm not sure what the name they call it in English. And uh, I put it in this tank. Uh, this old tank connected to the newer one through uh, inverted YouTube. And it's nothing, it's just an inverted YouTube so that the water will equalize on both sides. And I also use a small pump uh, to feed the, the blue growth bed from this tank. And uh, I also put some uh, big pump to for the water to circulate initially to provide some aeration. Right, uh, let's see, you can see some fish. These are all the fishes from my old tank. That's a lot of actually. Uh, koi, red tail barb, catfish, mancha, uh, and uh, I've put about 100 climbing perch. And uh, all are there. And uh, happily running around. Uh, I'm just making a short video because this is just an update and uh, nothing growing. I use a very small uh, aquarium pump for the growth bed. This is the water, the rate of water flowing in, and I'm using this pump over here. It's very hot over here now in Malaysia, so it's a bit glare because of the sun. That's the aquarium pump that I use. It's a 12 watt uh, aquarium pump. You can get one over here for roughly about 10 US dollar for one pump and it's good to switch off the pump at night so that the fish will clean the pump inlet uh, screen out of the food debris or, and also during the day it's good to switch off the pump occasionally so that it will maintain clean right uh, that's about all and this is the last of this uh, series of aquaponic video until I get something growing and then I'll make 
video updates again. Okay. Thank you. Bye for now.